Charge Shot. Welcome back to uh, Super Mario Sunshine, the game of your dreams, ladies and germs. Did you see how he just went in? <laughs> yeah, he just kind of slid in. He was like uh, horizontal. Gooper Blooper returns. Oh ain't no, that... I hate this. You know, I kind of hate this boss battle. You know, ain't that something? Glooper Blooper returns, everybody. I can't wait. That He's finally home. <laughs> Oops, I said the F word. We're gonna go. The o no, the only F word is fun. The only F word is fun. Uh, fun dip. Frankie. Fuckers. Fortnite. Fortnite. Um, Fig Newton bars. Yes, please. And, uh, and faggots. The last one especially. Filipinos. Filipino faggots. Yeah. That works. It's okay, there's a, there's a food called faggots, Brian. There is. Yeah, we're talking about the meatball. You know what's weird? I can't hear the music now. Well, that's what happens, ladies and gentlemen. That happened, indeed. Ah, oh, shit, they don't want you to stand on that thing. It was never meant to be, I guess. Take it easy. The answer is easy if you take it logically. Thanks for the crab apples, Giuseppe. Why can't you wall jump upon... What the fuck's up with this wall? I think you're too close to the wall. Jesus. Okay, you know what, I'm just gonna... God fucking... I just want to... <laughs> I want to be an acrobat, Brian. I you didn't go to college to be an acrobat. Dude, I didn't even go to high school. Yeah, I know. You, know, you should have went to college. I should have went to college, Peta. Oh, Peta. I wait. swear I hate this boss fight. Fuck, wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? There's a better way up here. Yeah, you could just get the rocket, can't you? The what now? The rocket nozzle. Reggie Rocket? No, the rocket nozzle. Dwayne the Rocket Johnson? He's my favorite wrestler. My favorite wrestler was Undertaker until he died. He's still alive. Didn't he canonically die in the WWE anime lore? No. When, when I was little, I never watched wrestling, but I always saw the commercials. And I could have sworn that he was, like, burnt alive or something. Not for real, because this is wrestling, but, like, he was burnt alive or something like that. Nah, he was still there. He's still there. They put him in a he coffin. Only he only shows up on WrestleMania. That was a buried alive match. Oh, I, I don't even know my wrestling. <laughs> you got, like, two health, dude. Yeah. That's me. I'm two health Jones. That's what they'll call Ace. me. Ants in your eyes, Johnson. I'm ants in my balls, Ron, Ron Jeremy. Fuck. Ew. Fuck. Okay, I did it. <laughs> How about them apples, eh? You should get health. Aw, oh, jeez. Shit on the floor. There's some, yeah, there's some right there. I really love how when Mario climbs, he goes, hoot, 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 hoot. <laughs> Let me just remind you how much I hate this boss fight. It's not that bad. I still hate it, though. Could be worse. Yeah, it could be. It could be the volcano. I mean, look, he's already dead. It's called Mount Corona, right? Yeah. Hi, Corona. Why did they name it after a beer? Maybe they named it before the beer. After no. a shitty pussy Mexican beer. I don't know. That's a weird thought. I never liked Corona. It's gross. Next time I charge out, we're both gonna get some. No, I'd r I would rather have some Rolling Rocks. Nah. I had, a, I had a big fucking can of Rolling Rock, and I saw Power Rangers in the theaters. But how? Oh wait, I thought you had Fireball whiskey. Yeah, we. Oh, okay. Um. Have I talked about this on Charge Shot? I think you may have. Well, we went to go see Power Rangers. Me and Nash. And we we uh <laughs> we were really stoned on our way there, way off our way out of our minds. Like I'm talking maybe I think it was like two to four joints, stoned. And so we had 
these big rolling rocks, these cans of rolling rock we got from this shitty mire. And we thought, you know what, we're not drunk enough to see this movie, Frank. That's what, that's what he said. So, we go to this Walgreens and buy a reduced price bottle of cinnamon whiskey. I don't know why it's reduced, but it's fucking big. Wait, hold up. They sell those at Walgreens there? Yeah. They only sell uh, alcohol at liquor stores here. <laughs> well, uh, well, we got this big-ass bottle of Fireball Whiskey, and we got to the theater, and he takes both of our drinks that we have halfway filled with Cherry Coke, and he goes in the bathroom with both of our cups, goes into the stall, and the madman pours half the bottle in each of our cups. We had a half a fucking, like, $30 bottle of, of Fireball Cinnamon Whiskey. <laughs> And Nash said, they say Krispy Kreme a lot in the um, Power Rangers movie. I heard a Nostalgia Critic review. So every time they say Krispy Kreme, take a sip. By the time we got to that point in the movie, I had already consumed the entire thing. Holy shit. <laughs> and I, I'd finished my drink. And he was like, Frank, you were supposed to wait. And I'm like, dude, no. I'm not waiting on you. <laughs> it was the Krispy Kreme's fault. Yeah, they do say Krispy Kreme a lot in the Power Rangers movie. They they were like Why? pushing the brand. Is there like a Krispy Kreme in Angel Grove now? Yes, and it was a major plot point. Really? <laughs> yeah. I don't want to see this shitty movie now. No, it was a very good movie actually. I thought it was bad because I thought the characters were horrible. No, I liked the characters. I don't know. Someone told me they were horrible that they didn't like the movie. And I loved the fucking Blue Ranger. He was the best part of the movie. And he fucking dies and comes back. Really? But the way he dies is so real and it's sad. I need, maybe I'll see it. I don't know. The Blue... They each kind of had a problem. Or like a quirk. I remember the Yellow Ranger was a lesbian Latino lady. That sounds weird. And uh, the Black Ranger was an autistic little black kid. I guess they were in... I don't know. Each, each one of them kind of had, like, a flaw. Oh my god, I'm sorry. The way I put it, Latina and black is not a flaw. I just mean that's what they were. Oh my god. <laughs> no, uh, someone, someone's gonna take that out of the fucking context. If they do, it's not your fault. I swear to god I'm not being racist. Yeah, you said they had other flaws besides that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, they had other flaws, Brian. No way, those are the only flaws. Oh my I'm god. I'm not a good jokesman. He's a real jokey joker. Was that it? Beat him on the first try. Was that seriously it? Yeah. Now technically, you don't have to do the stage after, which is the eight red coins. Easiest fucking Mario game. Wow. Your, the only things you're supposed to do are beat Shadow Mario in each of the levels. The eight red coins don't count towards Okay, so the game. would you advise I just ditch this level now? If you don't like doing the eight red coins, because I know there's... Oh, I absolutely hate it because it's the Yoshi one. The Yoshi one? I thought you had to ride the squid and collect them. No, it's Yoshi's Fruit Adventure. I just did the one at the squids, man. You haven't been paying attention. Damn it, I just, it like slipped my mind. Got it memorized. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, let me uh... I'm a dickhead. Let me go blow up the house. The castle, the lighthouse. Lighthouse? Let's, let's look, look at Toad. Hi, hold up, buddy. <laughs> What's he doing? He's, he's just kind of... Oh, he stopped moving. <laughs> he's like, I'm just gonna watch you do this. He's just watching me. Remember the Toad voice in Super, uh, <laughs> the, the Mario cartoon? Yeah, it's time to rock and roll! I hated his voice. I hated any episode that was dedicated to the little piece of shit. <laughs> Nobody likes Toad. Tell Toad to get the hell I love out. Toad. I hate that rendition of Toad. I hate Toad in uh, Mario Kart 64. You know what I hate more than anything? 
What? I hate Yoshi in that Super Mario World cartoon. What was his voice like? I don't remember. Fireballs, yum! Mama Luigi. Oh my god, that was so fucking loud. I'm, I know I just woke someone up. <laughs> Uh-oh. I'll have a hot Cheeto to that. Oh, you got the hot Cheetos already? Definitely. While you were telling your story, I was indulging myself in this Ben and Jerry's. That, that's that's a good way to go. That's a good way to spend the night. That's why I wasn't paying attention. To <laughs> that that that's a very good reason. Oh, Wait. You, can the, you can do the sandbird soon. Oh yeah, the sandbird. The sandbird. I never had trouble <laughs> with it. I don't know why people did. It's not that hard. People are just pansies. Watch, I say this and I get there and all I do is die. It's gonna happen. Hey, gonna Mario! Where was I during this adventure? You were at home, Luigi. Make, why didn't they make it like a sandcastle you can go in oh. instead of putting a goddamn <laughs> arrow? I don't know. <laughs> they got lazy. You know who else is lazy, right? Me. Me. Me too. I'm tired. It's like, I bet I can beat you in a lazy competition. How do you uh, set up a lazy competition? I don't know. Trick question, you don't. Trick question, yeah. Oh my god, trick question, you don't. You're too lazy to set it up. Exactly. Oh yeah, this one was always pretty easy to me. This whole game's fucking easy. Yeah, if you didn't want to try. Whoop, there we go. Whoop, there it is. We're already on star number 17. Next one is the one we gotta hit the things off the solar panels, right? Yeah. Can't wait Unless to do the fucking watermelons. That one <gasps> is the one I never really did. <laughs> Uh-oh. Next time on Charge Shot, we'll uh, keep. We'll, we're gonna ignore that big ship and keep going to the beach. Okay, see you next time.